We're out here in San Francisco on a beautiful Saturday morning. You hear the birds chirping. These little guys getting ready to jump and play volleyball. What's up guys? This is Coach Donnie with ElevateYourself.org. Welcome to the second Elevate Volleyball Tournament of 2019. And as you notice, we're in a new gym. That's Coach Vince right there. It was nice enough to host us. We're at Abraham Lincoln High School. So this is a really nice gym. You look how much space there is to serve and to pursue the ball. And look how high the ceiling is. And it's also real hardwood, so we're excited to play here today. So we're excited to test out these new jerseys that we got from Custom Fuse made by All Volleyball. There are logos here. One of the best online volleyball companies if you look for volleyball gear or equipment. Last night I didn't sleep until around 1 a.m. because I went to a Sammy Johnson concert and... People who are into island music, you guys know who he is. Uh, usually I try to sleep pretty early to get rest, but this was the only time that Sammy Johnson was gonna be in the Bay Area, so I had to see him. So we'll hopefully I can still play well today with some uh, sleep deprivation. We only got about five hours of sleep, which I don't recommend you that you guys do. We got the official foam rolling crew. It's warm up time. There's also a lot of glare and light coming in from those windows. <laughs> this is what our jerseys look like from the back. Can you see the back of your jersey? Oh yeah. And of course we have to have Yang with the beautiful bice uh, biceps and deltoids <laughs> model the front of the jersey. These are sick. Custom fuse, baby. <laughs> We just finished our first game and that was too close. If you guys watched the game from last tournament, by clicking up here, uh, we split with them and it was just mentally tough. We made a lot of errors and even though we had a strong start this time, both sets, we started losing focus toward the end. So we gotta, we gotta work on our mental toughness to be consistent. Hopefully we can do that for the second game.
second game and that was a struggle to do so well in the first game and then once again struggle in the second set. And it's good to have Yang back setting, but man, the hitters were just not connecting and everything feels a little bit awesome. Hopefully, hopefully we can figure it out for the third game because we gotta win at least one set or have a closer point differential to secure a gold playoffs. So there's a chance that we could get knocked down to silver. We got a special guest today. What's your name? What position do you play? What position do you play? Uh -oh. <laughs> and we just struggle with some of the simple things. John, post game analysis. What do you think has been our struggle today? Uh, it doesn't seem like really in sync. Uh, this last game was definitely serve received, but they were a tough serve, a tough serving team. Um, yeah, I think it's a cold. <laughs> <laughs> so now we are pretty sure we're in silver playoffs and which sucks because this is the first time we've ever been in silver playoffs. We've always been in gold for last year and this year so far. But that's a good sign because that means also means that the other teams are getting stronger and we want this league to get stronger so we can play against better competition. But it just sucks to be on the receiving end of that. Now we gotta focus on winning silver playoffs. Hey Aki. Playoffs just got announced, silver playoffs. We are, looks like this is happening first. Oh, we're wrecking and we're playing. All right. We gotta win silver now. This is the first round of silver playoffs between Slam Squad and Mental Block. So Slam Squad, which is also usually a gold division team in our league, also got knocked down to silver. And right now we're wrecking and we play Bay. Next. This is the first round of gold playoffs between Ball Please and Stuff Curry. Thank you. 
another future Olympian right here. Yeah. Is Jonathan. Oh. He's gonna learn to elevate himself at some point. I was just so cute. Yeah. Hey. Say hi, YouTube. Hello. We'll see you on the national team in 20 years. <laughs> We met some new friends today who came to watch the LV Volleyball League. You guys want to introduce yourselves? Hi, I'm Anthony. Hi, I'm Ryan. I'm Harvey. I'm Terry. We all go right. to Lincoln. Yeah, I'm Olympic. Yeah. There you go. Uh, I'm Nick. Ryan. I'm a mini coach tank. <laughs> <laughs> they play for uh, Coach Vince, so thanks for coming out and watch. Represent Mustangs, right? Lincoln, oh, yeah. boys volleyball. That, too. that guy, too. <laughs> we got the Dippin' Dot fundraiser to support the Lincoln High School Boys Program. Four dollars. I'll buy that. It's hot. Yes. Rainbow dipping dots. second third set match of the day and we've been struggling all day and we finally figured it out at the end it felt good to finish on a winning note but man we got a lot of work to do especially since we only have about three months until nationals so we got to figure it out so eric how did these jerseys feel we were repping these new uh, custom fused jerseys yeah. um, so the jerseys are really silky smooth they help with the nipple chafing um, <laughs> for sure Sweat doesn't really dry as fast on this. Um, yeah, it's comfortable. I like it. Cool. <laughs> One of the advantages of being a tournament director is you get VIP parking. I just finished the tournament and I gotta go to my mom's retirement party tonight, and I'm already running late. But before I go, I want to give a special thanks to John Huang, our opposite. As you guys know, it was my birthday early February, and he gave me a really good mic for my computer so I can have better sound quality when I talk. But man, what a generous guy, what an awesome teammate, and a really good person. So thank you, John, for this awesome gift, birthday gift. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>